I've just watched the Matrix 4 teaser which dropped last night in advance of the trailer that's coming out soon and it begins with the question what is real and I remember back when the first Matrix was released how it got us thinking about the state of the real are we living in a simulation and for centuries philosophers thinkers have tried to inquire into our perception of the reality that we live in and ask whether in fact all these things around us are out there in the world or just a product of our sensorial limitations and to no resolution. We still don't know whether in fact these things we touch, feel, hear, see are part of some orchestration of some other being that is out there trying to persuade us that what we live is consequential, is real and objectively out there in the world. Now, what's interesting, I think, is the fascination we have with this question. Why does it matter so much to us whether things are real? And to answer that question, we can look historically at a whole range of preoccupations that we've had about the real, whether it's computer games or social media taking us from some other reality that is of greater significance, or whether it's the anxieties that some physicians have had about excessive or maladaptive daydreaming. We are a species that's preoccupied with figuring out whether things are real or not, whether they are genuine, whether they're authentic. And actually part of the anxiety has to do with fears of the unknown, fears of the other, the things that take us away from the stuff that, that ought to matter. And we see historically as well an imposition of certain things mattering over others. So in some respects, the anxiety that we have, the virtual anxiety that the philosopher and social theorist Sarah Kember talked about, is an anxiety about change. It's about relocating us from one set of realities into another. And at the moment, in a world where we are on the cusp of moving ever into a virtual reality, a reality that may occupy more of our waking hours than the physical reality that we currently inhabit, is going to dramatically transform how we think about ourselves, but also how we relate to not only other humans, but other species too. Matrix 4 is going to be big, because it's going to remind us of this perennial question as to how we want to live. And that's why it's fascinating.